the new Waikato Vortex shutoff valve and flow sensor. The Vortex valve has taken two years of development. It's designed very specifically for high unit cars and achieves zero vacuum drop across the valve. It's designed to work specifically with automation systems and it works with all automatic cup removers. Uh, it's been very specifically designed to reduce vacuum drop across the shuttle valve, whereas most of other valves actually have quite a large drop. So the way we've achieved this is by having large 22 millimeter inlet and outlet nozzles. The main feature of the valve is actually that it creates a vortex shape with milk flow. So it achieves this by having a tangential entry from the inlet. The milk flows in, actually sticks to the outside wall of the valve and forms a vortex shape so it travels around in a spiral all the way through to the to the outlet. And what this does is actually of course creates a laminar flow. So basically the milk sticks to the outside walls of the valve, allowing the centre to remain an open air channel where vacuum can continue to come from the main vacuum supply the milk line up through the valve and out through the nozzle. So, so we basically have no plugging inside the valve so we have no vacuum drop caused by that plugging. The other neat feature with this is the, the sensing rings now which are used to determine the uh, end of milk point for the ACR. Um, big advantage of the ring itself is a much bigger surface area so the milk itself is much easier to detect and, uh, and the takeoff point itself can be very very accurately defined. Another neat feature is actually we're using a cable lug system where um, we actually bolt the lug and the cable to the stainless steel ring. The advantage of this over soldering is that soldering does deteriorate over time and does start or continues to keep corroding, whereas this will never actually corrode. And we also seal it in epoxy to make it a very permanent feature.